I call today's meditation Inside Beautiful, Outside Beautiful. We spend so much time trying to look good on the outside. For the next few minutes, let's relax and get in touch with our inner selves. Most of us walk around wearing our masks, trying so hard to fit into the world around us, trying to meet other people's expectations of ourselves, or even our own expectations of ourselves seen through people's eyes. And when we don't meet these expectations, we feel we have to protect. So we wear our masks, our work mask, or our parent mask, or our friend mask, because we worry that if we're really just ourselves, who we are at our core, it won't be good enough. So we use our masks to shield us from those inner voices that we all carry around. The ones that tell us that we're not good enough, that we're too fat or too thin, or too aggressive, or too passive, or not rich enough or successful enough. Often these internal voices come from our parents or from the culture that we've grown up in. We can feel defensive, and sometimes we don't allow our hearts to open fully. So let's connect to that inner beauty that we all have at our core. So getting started, settle into your seat, hands folded on your lap or in your thighs, your feet flat on the floor, and you can gently close your eyes. Let's take a few deep, relaxing breaths in through your nose and out through your mouth. On the in-breath, imagining pure, clear oxygen filling your lungs. And on the out-breath, allowing any tension that you may be feeling to leave your body like a gray mist. Do this a couple more times. And on your next exhalation, coming back to normal breathing, in and out through your nose. breathing effortlessly. Now shifting your attention to the body, noticing the contact points wherever your body is being supported, your back, your buttocks, your legs, even the floor below. Just allowing you the freedom to completely relax into this meditation. Tuning in now to your environment. Feeling of the air on your skin, the sounds around you, nearby sounds, maybe some sounds far off in the distance. Just take a few seconds to become aware of the environment. Now bring your attention back to the body, sensing how your body feels as a whole, not just physically, but emotionally as well. Let's scan the body slowly, becoming aware of your feet, 
Maybe taking a moment to appreciate how your feet fully support the entire weight of your body. Moving to your legs. Appreciating how your legs take you from place to place. And if any of these parts of your body aren't fully functional for you, recognizing that there's more right with you than wrong with you, as long as you're breathing. Becoming aware of your buttocks that allow you to sit comfortably. Your digestive tract that digests your food and provides you with nourishment. Your heart for pumping and circulating the blood throughout your body. Your lungs for giving you the nourishment and the oxygen you need to live. and maybe noticing how we sometimes take these things for granted. Maybe we beat ourselves up a bit because our bodies aren't perfect. Or if the person beside us is in better shape or better looking. So just noticing our tendency to be self-critical and recognizing when we find ourselves comparing or judging. Noticing how we can feel that we're not lovable just because we're not perfect. And now taking a moment to notice where you might be turning on yourself. Maybe in your role as a partner or at work or as a friend or as a parent or child. Maybe judging yourself about what you ate or what you drank. Where do you get into the myth of not enough? The feeling of lack. Taking a moment just to recognize the thoughts and feelings of what's here. Just allowing yourself to feel it without beating yourself up for the feeling. Now investigate. What's the belief right now? What does it feel like in your body? Be curious. How does it feel in your body when you're your own judge and jury? your own worst critic. Notice your throat, your chest, your belly. Now sense what it is that your body needs most. 
part that feels that it's somehow deficient. Maybe it needs love or to be seen or heard. Placing your hand on your heart, let yourself know that you're here. Begin to nourish yourself with that love. Sending yourself that love and feeling that self-compassion. And allowing that love to radiate from your heart center. You can tell yourself, shh, it's okay. I'm here. I love you. Imagine yourself being rocked gently. Wrapped and swaddled and completely held. Completely safe. Completely loved. Completely accepted. Feel as that warmth spreads from your heart center throughout your entire body. Now imagine that the mask that you've been wearing is made of wax. And as the light from within begins to burn brighter and brighter, feel the wax as it melts away. See your inner beauty as it shines brightly. Watch as it turns to an incredible white light. Feel it filling your heart center. Your entire chest filled with this white light. Each time it touches the mask, it melts it away. Moving to your torso. Feel the mask melting leaving behind a perfectly white light. Moving into your shoulders, your arms, your forearms, your hands, your fingers, your fingertips, your legs, thighs, calves, your ankles, feet, toes, your entire body radiating this white light, pulsing, feeling it all over. Now noticing how your body feels as it's bathed in this loving energy, this beauty, this love. 
this is you. This requires nothing else. This is perfection. Just resting in this perfection, allowing yourself to sink into this feeling, sensation. When you hear the bell, you can gently open your eyes. <laughs>